Nursing is a safety critical profession and the four pillars apply regardless of where we're working. We've decided to use these as the theme for our education day to really highlight and provoke some thinking around the four pillars and how they work in the care that we provide. So we have our clinical skills, we have our leadership, research and education. Education for nurses is important in all the fields. The transplant is a very uh, specific um, topic. Not every nurse wants to work uh, in a transplant setting because it's not only education, it's values, it's uh, attitude. We have a master's in transplant in Rome, with Gemelli in Roma, they, uh, with Gitmo. If we consider that uh, 30 years ago you became a nurse with a high school degree, so this is a big, big thing for us. In my center for education, they organize courses, uh, even uh, thinking about what happened the, the, the year before, the lacks of education to improve for the best, because uh, with education and trained nurses, you have better outcomes. And that's why we look back to not do the same mistakes and uh, improve our education. Nurses are uh, we're <laughs> all over. We work all together. There's all no nurses. We grow up if we work together. In reality, the four pillars are not separate and we use them in combination, particularly in complex scenarios. And it's really important to recognise this so that we can enable nursing to become sustainable and forward thinking. Nursing is continually evolving, not just in response to the advances in transplant cell therapy, but also those external factors that are impacting on our health systems. Uh, so nursing roles are changing, uh, we're seeing more advanced practice roles, and this is really an exciting time to be a nurse, uh, to be able to work in this field and have such an impact on patient care. There's a leader in us all, and uh, regardless of our roles and our status in our units, so whether we're doing a clinical or a research role, uh, we are making decisions that ultimately impact care at the bedside. Mm -hmm.